Hi right, guys, welcome to Shields Cooking. Today we're going to pay a tribute to one of my all-time favorite vegetables. And of course, I'm talking about the artichoke. It's been my logo for many years already, so I thought why not honor it by making it its own dish. So today, we're going to make a dish that's inspired by my logo. So it's going to be artichoke with mushrooms and leek. So, let's begin. We're going to begin with the artichoke cream. First, cut the ends from two artichokes off. Now transfer them both into a big pot and submerge them completely with water. For every liter of water you're using, add 10 grams of salt. Now bring this to a boil on a high heat and once it's boiling, set a timer for 2 minutes and then turn off the heat. Let the artichokes cool down in the water out of the fridge. After that, take them out of the water and remove the leaves. Then use a spoon to remove the center of the artichoke. Now cut them in big pieces and transfer 400 grams into a big saucepan. Also add 150 grams of the boiling liquid, 100 grams of double cream and 4 grams of salt. Bring this to a simmer for around 5 minutes and then transfer it into a blender. Mix this till it's completely smooth. Then pour it in a bowl and keep it in your fridge for later. Now for the mushroom duxelle. Transfer 250 grams of a variety of mushrooms on your cutting board and chop them fine. Then also clean one shallot and chop it. Now heat up a baking pan, add a splash of oil and glaze the shallot together with 4 grams of salt. Then also add the chopped mushrooms and bake this golden together with the leaves from 3 springs of thyme. After that add 100 grams of the vegetable stock and 15 grams of sushi vinegar. Reduce this completely and then transfer it into a bowl. Now add 70 grams of the artichoke cream and mix this. Then put it in a piping bag. Now we can start on the artichoke flan. Soak one leaf of gelatin in cold water. Meanwhile, transfer 250 grams of the cream into a saucepan together with 80 grams of the artichoke boiling liquid, 2 grams of salt, 60 grams of egg yolk and 10 grams of cornstarch. Mix this and then while stirring cook it on a medium heat till the desired thickness. Now press all the water out of your gelatin and dissolve it in your mixture. Then put it through a sieve. Put it in a piping bag and fill your molds halfway. Tap the bottom a couple of times to remove any air bubbles. Now pipe the mushroom duxelle in the middle and pipe the artichoke flan around it. Repeat the tapping process and make the top level using a pellet knife. Now let it set in your freezer. Then for the mushroom powder. I still had some mushrooms that needed to be used so I chopped them in thin slices and spread them on a tray covered with a silicon sheet. Now dry them in an oven at 60 degrees celsius. This takes around 5 hours. After that, transfer it into a blender and spin it till you're left with a fine powder. Then pour it in a bowl and keep it for later. Now for the balsamic jelly. Pour 100 grams of apple juice in a saucepan and also add 10 grams of soy sauce, 10 grams of sugar, 2 grams of salt, 20 grams of sushi vinegar, 50 grams of white balsamic vinegar and 1 gram of agar powder. Then soak 2 leaves of gelatin. Now bring the liquid to a boil for 2 minutes and once it has boiled, squeeze all the water out of your gelatin and dissolve it. 
Then fill your desired mold with the jelly. Now make it level using a pellet knife and let it set in your freezer. Now for the leek sauce. Cut two leeks in half and wash them under cold water. Then remove the green part. This you can use for a stock. Cut the remaining white part in small slices. Now heat up a pan and add a splash of oil. Then add 300 grams of the cut leek and glaze this together with 5 grams of salt. After that, add 200 grams of white wine and reduce this completely. Then add 900 grams of vegetable stock and 750 grams of double cream. Reduce this till two thirds. After that, add 200 grams of creme fraiche and blender this till smooth. Now put it through a fine sieve. This will go easier if you use a ladle. Give it a little taste and when necessary season with some salt. Now for the artichoke tuya. Pour 20 grams of hazelnut oil in a blender together with 30 grams of water, 2 grams of salt, 60 grams of the artichoke cream and 25 grams of flour. Mix this and then spread it on your desired mold using a pellet knife. Bake it at 150 degrees Celsius till golden. When still hot, remove the tuya directly from the mold, otherwise it will break. After that, also remove the flan from the mold and do this as well with the jelly. Put the jelly on top and then put it on a plate. Cover it with plastic foil and let it heat up in an oven at 50 degrees Celsius for around 20 minutes. Meanwhile, sprinkle some of the mushroom powder on the tuya. Then put the tuya on top as well. Now take your hot leek sauce and use a hand mixer and a spoon to make the sauce foam. Then carefully pour the sauce around the flan and then it's ready to be served. Okay guys, that's it for today. I hope you've enjoyed the video. So please let me know in the comments on what you want to see next and don't forget to subscribe. And as always, bon appetit!